God sees it all. Cannot hide anything from him. He says, over here is heaven. There's no sin in heaven. Looks at your life and says, I can see sin on your life. I cannot mix sin with no sin. Understand? And he says some terrible words. If you're not truly born again of his spirit, he says, depart from me. I never knew you. Not to do with church, nothing. He said, I never knew you. So, got to get this right. If you're truly born again of his spirit, something different happens on that day. Jesus Christ takes all the sin of your life. He gives you something back. His righteousness. Think about this. His righteousness. When God looks at you, if you're born again, he sees the righteousness of Jesus. No sin. No sin on you. No sin in heaven. There's your past. That's how it works. So you've got to get this right. So, here we are. Stands at the door of your life. And he knocks today. And he says, if Adam, if you hear my voice, you open the door, I will come in, I'll wash away all your sin, I'll give you my righteousness, I'll give you my new newness of life. Okay? And you will be safe in my hand if something happens to you. So today, I'm going to invite you to pray with me according to the Bible and get this right. All right? 100%. Okay? Can we just, just hold on that? Is that okay? Is that yeah, body? Uh, is all right if I just do it like Okay. All right. You do it like that. Ready? Bow your head. Look away to Jesus. Don't think about me. You say, Heavenly Father, I ask Jesus into my life. Come in and wash away all my sin. Give me all your righteousness. I believe you died for me and that you rose again. I give you my life. I turn away from my sin and according to your word, I am born of your spirit. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Okay. Now that might that might just seem like a simple prayer, but think about this. He said, if you confess me before man, I will confess you before my Father in heaven. It's like a record in heaven. You are safe in his hand. And Jesus himself said, once the Father puts Adam into my hand, which he's done today, nobody. The Greek word says, there's no possibility that anybody, even yourself, can ever snatch you out. You are safe in his hand, right? This is so exciting, Adam. I spoke to a young Catholic girl at Chatsworth the other day. She did the same thing. She was so excited. She said, I, I know this is right. I know it's good for me. I know that I'm safe in God's hand. Yes. Because you've got to listen to Jesus, okay? Not about church. I'm not saying church is wrong or anything like that. I'm saying listen to Jesus. All right? I'm going to give you a Gospel of John to take with you. All right?